Hi there guys, welcome back to the channel. Thanks very much for joining us again today. I've got a very short video tutorial for you today that will show you how to send emails using MailChimp. Just before I get into that and show you, if you haven't tried MailChimp before, if you want to give it a go for any particular reason, then you need to click the link in the description down below and you will access a free trial version of the software. So we've provided that for you. Uh, make sure you give it a link, give the link a click and that'll take you straight through then. So once you're in, this will be the dashboard that you see, and you'll be able then to create an email campaign from a couple of different places. You've got this create a campaign button right here. If you go to create in the top left or campaigns, just underneath it, you've got that create a campaign button right there as well. So we're just gonna send a regular email to some people today. Before you've done so, I would recommend um, building either a list of contacts or adding some contacts. And you can do so through the audience drop down menu and then add your contacts there. If you also go to all contacts, you can add them by clicking add contacts right there and then add a subscriber. So it's got a form that will allow you to add a subscriber or a contact to your audience as it's referred to in MailChimp. And it's got some uh, information there. The only thing that's required is the email address okay so the all all the other stuff is optional once you've got that in place then and you've created an audience to send them an email just hit this regular email option on the left hand side and then that will take you through then to the kind of email builder which is similar to weebly in the sense that you can click and drag these elements and drop them into the interface and it's got that line that denotes in which area it's going to appear and then um, so it's not like drag and drop to the exact kind of precise you know detail that something like photoshop or wix would be but um it's it's much similar to kind of um like a pre-formatted builder like weebly would be you can see that every element then when you click on it has its own little menu that pops up on the left and the toolbar on the top changes depending on what you've got selected and then you've got these little social media icons right down here at the bottom and you're able to input your social media links very easily there so everything's very easy everything's very intuitive looks very similar to a mobile app and it's very simple to use once you've built your message and you're happy with the look of it hit save and exit in the top right hand corner and that will then take you to this page where you can add recipients so from your audience that you built earlier as i instructed you to um you can add kind of that list there um and then you know you can add a form to it change this you know dictate the subject line for the campaign and then just confirm the content there that it you know you can see that you can send a test email if you need to but you can kind of see a preview of it there if you give it a single click and then um once you're kind of done with that process and you're happy with all of the settings all you need to do then is hit send in the top right hand corner you've also got the ability to share links to your social media here as well as create a custom url for it as well so yeah that's it that's how you'd send an email and that concludes the video so just before i go i'd just like to mention that i've left a link to a uh, software that ranks your website instantly using videos so it might be very interesting to the viewer who's looking for more traffic and sales to their website so make sure to check that out if it's something that you think you need and uh, if you've enjoyed the video and you want to see more content of this nature give us a like and subscribe to the channel and if you've got any questions or suggestions for future videos leave them as comments down below as well thank you very much